It's time. It's time. You hungry? Because it's time for it's Jordan's exciting cooking show. Ooh, what are we do? What are we gonna cook today? That's exciting. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Today we have a very tasty, tasty dish that we're gonna cook up for y'all. It's one of my favorites: spaghetti bolognese. And it is easy. That's exciting. You're gonna need some celery, some carrots, a jar of marinara sauce. That's right, not just regular spaghetti sauce. Some onion. You're not gonna need, but you might want some garlic bread to go on the side. You're also gonna need heavy whipping cream. I usually buy organic heavy whipping cream, but they're out, they're out of it at the store. And uh, I usually buy a fresh block of Parmesan, as you know, but they're sold out of those everywhere, too. I'm not sure what's going on. Of course, you're gonna need spaghetti. Beef, maybe two pounds. Some people will use a pound of ground pork. That's not what I'm doing. I'm doing two pounds of ground beef because that's what we like. Shred up your carrots, celery, your onions, and get ready. <laughs> One cup of shredded carrots, right in the pan. In there we got about two tablespoons of olive oil. Life hack, if you don't wanna cry while you're chopping onions, you just close your eyes and look up into the sky while you chop them. It didn't work at all. I was trying to be slick and make it so I could just slide the onions right into the pan. Apparently my life hack didn't work either because I'm fucking crying. Hey, no joke though. People don't tell you this stuff in these videos usually. I feel like this takes a long time to chop all this stuff up. I got new braces, they're green. Exciting. All right, about a cup. We're gonna get it started over here, all right? About a medium high. I got celery all over the floor now. I hate stepping stuff. So yeah, you're gonna do this. You're just gonna do this for like three minutes. I know what you're probably thinking. Like, wow, that's a lot of vegetables. I thought this was a meat sauce, a spaghetti bolognese meat dish. Well, it is, but if you go get a good spaghetti bolognese somewhere, I'm telling you, it's gonna be with that stuff in it. So I got some organic grass-fed ground beef here. Boom, I'm gonna dump that right in. I got two pounds of it. We gotta pick up the celery pieces from the ground. Just stepping on them drives me bananas. We're gonna mix that right in with our other stuff we got going on here. We just keep on stirring that stuff up until your meat's nice and cooked. Doesn't this kind of look like Christmas? All right, our meat and vegetables is looking real, real good. It's starting to smell real good in here too. So now we're gonna grab our jar of marinara. Yeah, at this point, you're gonna wanna turn it down to low and just let it simmer. Salt, pepper, and celery salt. And just let it simmer for like 30 minutes, 35 minutes. Honestly, the longer you let it go for, the better your sauce is gonna taste. If you just let this sit here for the next two hours on low, your pasta is gonna taste so good. All right, it's 4.42. So we're gonna come back to this in 30 minutes, which will be 5.15, give or take. Uh, don't leave this just sitting here for 30 minutes without looking at it, you gotta stir it for sure. But during that 30 minute window while you're waiting for this to be ready for your next step, you should clean up all of this. All right, so it's been about 30 minutes. Final step is to add heavy whipping cream. Stir it up. So, the only thing left to do now is to cook up your spaghetti number 12 by 
Wow, that's exciting. <laughs>